In this video, I'll show you how to create a new collection template in Shopify DOM team. For this example, I'll create a custom template and apply it to sale collection. So first of all, let's log in Shopify admin account, and then select online store. Now locate your active team, in my case it's DOM version 15.2.0, and then select customize. Once the editor loads at the very top, click on home page, and then select collections. Now click on create template. Let's call it sale collection template. It's going to be based on default collection and then select create template. Now click the very top and then select collections and make sure the new collection template is selected right here. Now on the left under preview, it says all, let's change it to our sale collection. Let's pick it right here. And these are all the products in my sale collection. Now let's make the adjustment to the template. Uh, on the left, click on collection banner. We can change uh, the settings here. Maybe show the collection description, show image. I'll keep it the way it is. All I'm going to do is change the actual scheme. Let's click on scheme and change it to scheme three. It's going to be red. Then let's make changes in the product grid. Let's select product grid right here. And in the grid settings, let's uh, change the number of um, columns on desktop. Instead of four, I'll change it to six. And then also let's change the color scheme. I'll pick the color scheme too. And uh, we can also adjust um, the quick add feature. Let's change it to bulk. And of course, you can change the settings however you like, but I will keep it very minimal. So once you make all the changes, just save the template. Now, once the template settings are saved, we have to actually apply the template to the sale collection. For that, let's exit the editor. Now let's click on products and then look for collections. Now, right here, let me find sale collection. Let's open it. Then on the right side of the screen, look for theme template. Let's expand it and then pick the new collection we just created. In my case, it's this one, sale collection template. Let's select it and press save. Now allow a few minutes for the changes to update and then go back to the website. Let's try refreshing the sale collection. Let's wait a few more minutes. In my case, it took about a minute for the change to update. And so you can notice the sale collection now features different color scheme. And there are now six columns on the product grid. And of course, there's also the bulk add feature right here. And just for the reference, if I click on catalog, this is what the default collection template looks like, whereas the sale collection has the new updated template. So that's pretty much it for this video. I hope you found this tip helpful. And for more shop tutorials, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.